friends, my name is Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales, and welcome to Update Monday, a regular channel update, or semi-regular uh, channel update. Welcome to New Dragon's Lair, which you'll see in the room behind me. We've got some of my Game of Thrones stuff, my Targaryen banner, my map, my uh, Stark Dial banner. I've got, well, you won't be able to see it, because, well, actually, you will be able to see it. Just below the microphone, you can see I've got a... Uh, BB-8, a Sonic, a Stormtrooper, a Game of Thrones pillow. Uh, yeah, it's all taking shape slowly. Um, it's very messy in here at the moment. But if you look at the video that went up last week, it's a house tour. Um, so me and Panda basically spend 20 minutes going through all the rooms in the house. Um, some of the stuff hasn't been set up in that video, which has been set up since. I might do an update for that at some stage. An update and an update, update exception. But yeah, generally pretty happy with how things have gone. So what can you expect from me going forward with the channel? I plan to do some live streaming. So this past weekend, I had lots of fun. I did a 720p test stream. And that 720p test stream was using wireless. Now the reason why it was on wireless and not using an ethernet cable is because our hub for our internet is based downstairs and where this room is right now in the house is kind of like the extension so in order to get an ethernet cable running downstairs you'd either have to go down the room through the hallway down the stairs around the sort of door frame into the door into the living room and then to the far end of the living room or i'd have to, which, which would not work it would be kind of awkward or get a drill drill a hole into the window pane, the wood on the window pane, thread the ethernet cable through that, drill another hole into the roof of the utility room, thread it through that, and then feed the ethernet cable through another drilled hole in a window pane and into the living room that way. Both scenarios are not ideal, so I wanted to test out the wireless settings instead, which is what we did. So we tested them out with 720p stream on the Friday. That's right, on Friday, and we played some Warhammer 2, the Icket Claw campaign. Must say, side note, campaign's really good. Enjoying this DLC from CA, so keep it up, guys. Lovely stuff. Really enjoying the whole mechanics with the Skaven. But anyway, go back on point. Did the test stream, no drop frames. I did the maximum for a 720, because if you go into YouTube, it gives you like um, a checklist of what bitrate you should be using for what settings and that sort of thing. I did a 4,000 kilobyte bitrate thing, whatever that is, um, <laughs> for the 720p settings, and it worked lovely. And I had no drop frames throughout. Everybody in the chat was saying it's working really well, looking nicely, and it made my day. Because if you're a long-time subscriber or viewer of this channel, you've known me for a few years, like I've been doing this for over five years on YouTube, and, uh, you know, I've had to put up with kind of terrible internet lots of delays, lots of lagging. I've had to like bulk upload as much as I can to release stuff because I couldn't keep up with other channels that are doing similar content to me. I've always felt like I've been on a kind of fighting or losing battle, I guess. And it's mad because we're living in the same village I was living in before. The only difference is that I'm living the other side of the village in my own house rather than in my parents' house. So there's that caveat as well. But luckily where we are, it's quite close to a community centre, which which is just sort of based up the road by there, um, which comes under the same postcode address as us, so it just shows you how close it is. And obviously a community centre is going to want to have internet access and stuff. We're not too far away from the exchange, it's, I think it's like about 400 yards or so up the road by there, so not too bad either. And we're getting good speeds, we're getting, I believe it's between sort of 40 to 50 megabytes download and I should be getting 8 as a minimum upload but I've been getting about 15 to 19 so I'm getting well beyond the minimum so I'm really happy with that and that's why I've been having no issues with the streaming and stuff so long story short did the 720p stream it worked without a hitch no problems at all really really happy with it so I thought right we're gonna bring things up a notch Saturday I'm gonna stream again I'll do a couple hours Saturday I'm gonna do 1080p 60 frames per second and I'm going to play a game that's a bit more demanding as far as the internet goes 
I'm going to play PUBG because PUBG, you're on a server, so you've got server lag and issues like that you have to deal with. I'm also going to have Discord on. If anybody wants to join me on Discord, they can play that, uh, play play with me using Discord. So I've got that on as well. Um, whereas before, like to give you an example, in my parents' house when I was streaming, I would struggle having Discord on sometimes. So this gives you the kind of the, the two ends of the spectrum. So I played PUBG again, streamed for two hours. Susu played with me. He was on Discord with me. No drop frames at all, no issues, and it was an absolutely fantastic stream. I ended up showing my underwear. <laughs> I had like butler underwear on, so I showed everybody that in the chat. Don't why? Got to be excited, I think. And your support was absolutely overwhelming in the stream. I had two very, very kind donations. I had one donation for 120 US dollars, which is absolutely like I was. I was shocked and I felt like a dick as well because I had the person's name wrong in the chat when, when it happened. It caught me off guard because I was talking to Jackasaurus in the stream and then the donation came up and I thought it was Jackasaurus. Totally, completely like blurred the, the name, or, you know, at least I blurred the name myself. The name wasn't blurred at all. And then spent like 10 minutes apologizing. <laughs> but it just blew me away, um, Storm Peak for the old donation. But I actually, um, Wanted, I like to give something back whenever I can. I always say this. So I actually got him a gift, one of his games that he had on his wish list on Steam, to show my appreciation back because, you know, your support to the end of the day is what makes this this community that we have on our channel quite awesome, to be honest with you. And then I had another donation after that then from Jack himself as well. So two great donations from both of you. So thank you so much again. I said thank you like a hundred times now, but I am very thankful, so thank you so much for that. But the stream, like I said, went really well. I can't falter at all. And then fast forward to yesterday, which was Sunday. Uh, the day started off with me and Panda watching Lord Rex Saw's live stream. He's playing the Ikid Claw Skaven campaign for Warhammer 2 himself. So we watched that for a bit, interacted with him. It's quite cool to see him streaming for, for a change. We actually watched him on the TV downstairs, and then I had my, I had my tablet like commented and stuff because on the playstation because we watched it on the playstation 4 i hate the fact you can't like chat properly on it so i, I ended up watching it on the screen then commented using the tablet it was just easier to do it that way um and that was fun and then we, we went then because we went to see carlos city play liverpool my local club versus my boyhood club and it was interesting liverpool won two nil i got this feeling they're not going to win the league i honestly think they won't win the league i think man city will beat man united I just can't see Man City dropping any points between now and the end of the season. So I think Liverpool are going to finish second. It was going to be crazy the fact that they're going to finish second and possibly end up on 97 points. That's just ridiculous. Just shows you how tight this title race has been. But it's really exciting. Um, as far as Cardiff goes, I hope they can get more points and stay up. It's still possible. They have got a couple of games left that are winnable. So fingers crossed they can win them. Um, I'd love to see Cardiff stay up and Liverpool win the league. That would be like a dream season for me. But hey, we'll see what happens with the football. A few non-football fans, you obviously want to know what's going to happen with the channel going forward. So, like I said, I've done the 720, I've done the 1080, they both worked without a hitch. So from this point on now, I'm going to be streaming 1080p, 60 frames per second, going forward. I'm going to be doing Fallout New Vegas, because I promised Jackhammer that I would do it ages ago. I've actually installed it now on the PC. Um, I just got to get all the mods that he sent over to me installed because I did say I'd mod it to the sort of mods that spec that he wants. I'll try them all out and I'll just do like a playthrough. So I'm hoping to get that started at some point soon. That'll be pretty cool. Um, I also have Apex Legends installed because Susu and Rex are so, have both nagged me to install it. I have not played it at all yet. I've just installed it and that's it. But from what they were telling me, you have like three, you're like a team of like three players. It's a bit like PUBG. It's like a battle royale type game, but it's fun. So I'll give that a go. Maybe stream that or play with them just off camera or something or record it. And that's the other things over the recording. So my video that went up last week, the 20 minute uh, vlog of me and Panda going around the house doing the house tour, that took 20 minutes to upload. I was shocked. I recorded it in 20 minutes. I then did a little bit of editing. I rendered it, that took 20 minutes. I clicked the upload button. I let it go in the background. I started doing a couple of other things. I just went back to it then, just to change like the, the, thumbnail, uh, the thumbnail and like the title. I was like, what? 
20 minutes. It's done 10% already. What? I'm just going up and up and up. I was like, oh my god. Because usually what happens when I'm at my parents' house, I, I'll put like a 20 minute video on to upload. It'll take like three and a half hours or four hours, depending, you know. And it's crazy because it's like it goes up to like an hour, then it'll go up to like 120 minutes. And it'll go up to like two hours and, and, and three hours, and then it'll just like go off the things where you've got no hours left. It's like, oh, it's going to take forever. But no, this one went up really quickly. So really, really happy with the internet. It does mean that I should be able to get content out a bit quicker than before. I do have plans away from streaming to do more of the top five Total War stuff. I'm going to continue that by doing the top five worst DLC. I did do the top five best DLC about two or three weeks ago. So that I do plan to do more of them because they are fun videos to make. And then if you've got any suggestions for other ones, any type of videos you'd like to see, whether it's be Total War related or not, please let me know because I'm open to suggestions as well. I see this as a lovely kind of opportunity to have a fresh start with things on the channel. There will be games I'm going to want to play in stream because the thing is now I'm more likely to play more games now I can stream again because I found before I didn't have time to... I, I find it difficult to to play through a game off off stream. I'd rather buy a game and play it all the way through. Like I got all the Batman Arkham games, so I will probably stream all them eventually as well. But it's like in the past, I did like Mass Effect, Mass Effect 2. We could do Mass Effect 3 because I haven't played that yet. So there's games out there that I want to play. But I do like playing narrative based games, which has like a definitive beginning, middle, and end. I'm playing all the way through and experience it. And if I can share that experience with you, it's all the better. Okay, guys, so I think that ends it here. I've been Dragonheart. Thank you for watching. Have a good week. See you soon. Bye for now.